To this first wall is done today again it's gonna be rainy and, and with showers but we're gonna try to get that wall done and if we are lucky maybe the third one the front one which is the same length than this one but uh, with a door in the middle where you see the step why are you opening the new ladder, which I'm really excited about because, as you all know, I didn't manage to be able to open the other one comfortably. And this one is really pretty. Okay. Which one it is? This one. <laughs> Looks good, eh? I don't think you're gonna fall from here. <laughs> it's gonna come handy for when we do this part of the roof.
We just stopped for snack break. I need to finish cutting the anchor bolts. I already cut up to that corner over there. And um, I decided to do the whole thing so I don't have to do this tomorrow again. Eugenia also finished putting all the gravel here. She did an amazing job. Every time that we were stepping on the slab, we were staining it with the mud. It's not a big deal, but then we don't want to see it getting stained because we work very hard. Also yesterday I scratched a little bit the ground, the concrete. It's not a big deal either, but uh, I did scratch it with the with the wall. I think with this with this guy. So today I'm gonna try to be a little bit more, little bit more on top of that, so I don't scratch anything else. And we have decided that we're gonna both do one wall and see which one is faster. So Jenny will be doing that wall, and I'm gonna be doing that wall, and we're gonna time ourselves to see who can build it faster who do you think leave your leave your bets in the comment i won't take it personally i think eugenia is gonna win though because she's faster with the impact driver and i don't know we'll see what do you guys think all right guys i'm gonna finish my drink All right, so we're ready to to start putting together the second wall. We just put this membrane here just to protect the concrete slab a little bit. And we're ready to go, no? Are we? This is the alt, no? The más pequeño. Venga, este va aquí. Vale, siguiente. Enfrentada con el V1. Ah, sí, ¿no? Sí. Venga, pues dame el otro vertical. Uno, dos. Cara mirando a Alt V3.
what you want. Good job! <laughs> Yenia? It's time to start screen. Quality control. Quality control is okay? Good. All right, guys. Eugenia is going to be the first one in the competition. Let's see how fast she can do it. I'm going to go grab the timer. Espérate, espérate. Espérate que no tengo el teléfono. <laughs> Eugenia, people is cheering for you. <laughs> She's getting nervous. <laughs> Run, 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 run! <laughs> no, be careful, don't hurt yourself. Eh? <laughs> All right, two screws. No, three, three screws still. Good job! <laughs> All right. To put together that wall, which is not an actual easy wall, it's like you know, with all the triangle shapes and everything. So not bad, eh? It's fast. It's super fast. Do you like the new screws? I'm impressed. This is the bit for these screws that you can push it in and it stays there. You have both holes in the structure that are already pre-cut. You insert the point of the screw in the hole and then you just, and it's all in. And now also another thing that I want to show with this impact driver that, uh, that we own is I, I just remove the bit for the normal screws and I do like this socket, you do like that. You do like that and you don't need any adapters it's already embedded in the in the actual machine which is kind of cool
tú? ¿Dónde está? ¿La broca, tío? No. <risa> I cannot misplace this because this is the only one that we have. And it's like 40 euros. So I don't really want to have to buy another one. But totally worth it though. If we do it again, not sure if we will use these screws or not, just because of the money. Because the big project is gonna be a big project, so we're gonna have a lot of screws. Eugenia, I don't know if you agree or not, but I have to say that these screws are very good. Well worth its and value. And also, we wanted to use it here because, first of all, to try them out. We have read a lot about, about them, but we never actually use them. And also because because the interior of the workshop is going to be exposed. So, I don't know. I don't know if you agree or not, but uh, this head of the screw is very nice looking. So we were like, and there are not that many screws for, for this structure. So the, the difference wasn't very big. After using it for the first time, I think we might we might use it for, for the big house. screw more we stopped for a minute for a quick break so we could have some water and a toast this wall is ready so looking nice and straight and perfectly planned by the way we, this is something like really good I haven't used my measuring tape since we started assembling walls which is kind of crazy because Once you assemble everything, once you put everything together, you know 100% that it's a straight, plumb, vertical and horizontal, everything is fine. Which is a big improvement. I don't know if you remember for the cabin, we had to be like pushing from one side, uh, making it very vertical and then screwing, which is kind of nice. Kind of like it too, but this is way faster, I think, in my own personal opinion. I'm gonna go ahead and start assembling The second wall by the way we have this pipe here which is kind of high for the electrical cable to go inside the workshop and we might trim it a little bit so we don't have to raise the wall so high because i don't think we will be able even though it's light well, we might try to leave it like that
Can I call it? Oh, what out? Really? Oh no, man, it's not fair because now I'm tired. <laughs> Excuses. <laughs> I am as ready as I can be. Okay, time? But you don't have the time. No. But you need to press this because, because if not, I'm, I'm wasting time. Is that ready? Come on! <laughs> Cogelo! Aspen, tío. Aspen, I'm gonna lose, man. Aspen. Aspen, good job. <laughs> Screws? You don't wanna give me screws? So we had to remove the wall. We had to remove the second wall because there is some some concrete here that, that is sticking up and it's making the wall to be higher than this one. Uh, we have a few a few holes here, one here, obviously this one, this is for the electrical, but we have this circular one and another circular there on top, which is, is there just to make sure that you align both walls. So, so both of them, they are not like this, they are perfectly level with each other. Um, we didn't do a very good job in this area of the concrete, like maybe, what would you say, like this half a meter in, no? Because we couldn't pass the... Yeah, because there were there were a lot of pipes sticking out and things like that, uh, so we weren't able to pass the bull float and the Fresno travel. 
we actually didn't care too much because this is going to be hidden all by like like a set of closets from floor to ceiling we have to fix it i'm going to try to grind with this which i have never used we bought this a while ago and we never used it um so it's perfect time to to use that i'm going to try to grind this a little bit and also here and there i made i made some marks this is sticking out it's just half a centimeter like three eighths of an inch not much but uh, enough for for the wall not to fit so, yeah and then also here i need to grind here also being careful not to not to cut the the strip Nice, eh? This is definitely my favorite tool so far. <laughs> it's amazing, eh? Mm -hmm. It is amazing, eh? Me va, güey. Un poquito más. ¿Qué tal? This is looking good. We have all the wall set and plumbed and ready. And now 
we put all the anchor bolts we will come back later and replace this washer by an L so the L will do like this we will screw the L to the concrete and also to the stud uh, which is kind of nice detail that the blocking provided for us so we will do that for every single anchor bolt so everything you see here is just temporary you can see here these holes this is a hole I did wrong uh, this hole uh, is the same in both profiles in this one and in that one so that way you can align you can align both walls I've been using I have been using this I think it's 15 millimeter drill bit and I'm be putting it here and making it short making sure so pushing in one way or another to make sure that the these three holes I don't know if you can see the holes man there you go these three holes and we have a one small one here one bigger one where it, that is where I put the, the drill bit and then we have another the small one there so I've been pushing it like that because that's what I needed in my case and then clamping it with that guy and once once I had it once I had it clamped I did this hole but I clamped it too high so when I removed this then the hole moved again I didn't notice and I made the first hole and then I realized so I removed that uh, that the screw did the hole did this thing again and clamped it here very close where I wanted to screw and that came out perfectly as you can see the holes are perfectly aligned you can see through them and then we have the same situation we have the same three holes up there which I have just set but as you can see there you go there you have the three holes And the clamp, and I already I already set this up, so I just need to screw. Looking good, guys. I'm gonna go down, leave the camera, and finish screwing this because you need to screw it like every 60 centimeters, like every two feet or so. So we'll go one screw there, 60, 60, 60, and I'm gonna do the same in that corner. I already put one screw here. So I will repeat that every 60 centimeters. And actually do it in every 40 centimeters. Just because I have a bunch of screws and I don't know, just feel like it's better. Thank you. 